Welcome to Tabletop Tactics. Coming up in today's battle... Welcome, free view, to this special... Uh, well, this is the problem. Neither of us have lungs to blow the horn. Because no. we're both using the brand new hey! Death Armies! We're both dead! Oh, praise be, I oh. finally shuffled off the mortal coil. I'm a skeleton. You're a vampire, so you'll technically have some remnants of life. I'm just a reanimated skeleton. If vampires were real, I'd want to be a vampire. I, I feel like... Um, not being able to walk around in the day and the occasional sort of bit of blood sucking. I wouldn't is... want to live forever though. Ah, uh, see, I would. I would get so much done. That's true. Think about it as well. You can sleep during the day. I'm a night owl anyway. Like, I'd be super fast. I'd be super strong. My knees wouldn't creak all the time. I could no, fly. No, your floorboards would though, because you'd be a very aesthetic and creepy vampire with a creepy house. Because if you wouldn't do that, you're doing vampires wrong. So today we are running the Soul Blight Grave Lords for your viewing pleasure. A classic army uh, with a classic theme that I have going on, which we will get on with this. And the Ossiarch Bone Reapers. Again, it's 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 a list that you probably have seen a lot because we don't have a lot of variety in it. But we can see how it's changed, which is exciting. Yes, comparisons and contrasts are good. A uh, controlled experiment. Nice. Very good. Yes. Well, let's have a look at the lists <laughs> and see how controlled this game will be. The answer is not, not very. So. No, it's me mm -mm. and Jinx playing. It's going to be. Chains. It's going to be a nightmare. <laughs> Belated birthday to me. It is the second brand new battle tome in a row that I get to play with because apparently the gods that be looked down at me and said, do you know, do you know that Jinx? She she deserves new battle times for her army. She's been toughing it out. She's been slogging through through um, Age of Sigma for a while. We'll give her a little helping hand. And I said thank you. Thank you to Slanesh and, and now the High Lords of Skeletons. I assume that's Jack Skellington. So thank you, Disney. We will go into the list. It's very similar because we don't have that much variety with the Ossiak Bone Reapers, but there will be some changes. So I will be taking the Mortis Praetorians today because they have a lol I get to counter charge you thing and that just seems like it's fun. So that's what I will be taking. My general is going to be Arkan because why would I not have Arkan? He's just the best. And in effort to make the list a little bit more simpler for my brain to, to kind of cope with because I'm learning two new books at the same time right now, I've not got any other carry oh, generals, leaders, that's the one. So I don't have to worry about any artifacts of power or command traits. Going into the rest of my army, I do have my three squads of Mortec Guards, so that's three squads of ten. I do have a single squad of the Kavalos Death Riders. I have two of the Stalkers because they're really cool and scary and I hope... I'm quite curious to see how they're different because their, their faces have changed a little bit, their precision aspects have changed a little, a, a little bit, so I'm, in, I'm interested to see how they do. I do have the Gothasar Harvester because... It's a skeleton carnifex, why wouldn't I take him? And I have the Mortec Crawler. And finally, I have an Emerald Life Swarm to try and stay alive as much as I can. For my grand strategy, I have taken the Pride of Osea, which is I have to have successfully completed four battle tactics from the Osiarch Bone Reapers battle tactics. And I think that's just gonna force me to try and use them so I can show off to you guys some of the new stuff in the new book because I am very kind and gracious. Tis I, Vampire Lord Chef. Bleh. I'm taking control of the Soul Blight today because Lawrence is busy. Um, and also because then it gives you some variety because I'm not running the Zombie Dragon. Instead, I have gone old school. I am running lots of infantry characters and lots and lots of undead shambling hordes, which is very, very cool. 
So we are running Legion of Blood today. Um, now I've only got two vampires in my army and that's all that is affected by their battle trait, but it's a pretty cool battle trait. I get plus one to cast if I'm more than three inches away from enemy units. And if I'm within three inches, I get plus one attack. It's nice and simple. If you're going vampire heavy, it's only vampire hero. So no, 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 no extra special blood knights for you, I'm afraid. But it's pretty cool. It does also unlock some very nifty heroic actions, which I can do instead of normal ones. One of which is one of my characters can just ignore ward saves, very potent. And the other one is if you want to do all out defense or I believe inspiring presence whilst you're within 12 inches of this hero, it costs you two CP, which is very, very cool. Now my general is a vampire lord on foot. I actually have two of these. We've got first vampire lord on foot as my general. She has taken doomed minions as her uh, command trait, which is at the beginning of the game, I believe it's after deployment, I can roll D3. I pick that many non-hero, non-monster units. And if they are within three inches of my general, they are always hit on a two, regardless of who's attacking them, which is very cool indeed. We've also given them a relic, the cloak of mists and shadows. So they ignore all positive and negative modifiers to their save. So they become a ghost, a spooky ghost. We then have a second vampire lord, a classic Lamian model. So I felt like I had to use the Legion of Blood here. And they are just as they are. The spells will come up in game. We then have a white king on foot. Those of you old hammer players will recognize this model. Yes, he is awesome. We also have a white king on skeletal steed. Now we do have a white king model, but I thought keeping with the theme of going old school, I've used the old Manfred von Karstein model. I know it's not quite fitting with the theme of the Legion of Blood, but just think of it as a um, enslaved uh, hero to my vampiric whims. Okay. Okay. We then have a necromancer. Just a necromancer, just a little necromancer running around. Now in this army, I do have a battle regiment, a Galatian champion, um, detachment and a warlord detachment. All my characters will fit into various things. Um, Krell, the white king on foot, and a unit of 20 grave guard will be my Galatian champion sub. Everything else will, it will become pertinent. This will unlock an extra enhancement for me, which I will use for some Galatian enhancements because they're cool. Okay. We then go over to my battle line and there's a lot of it because I'm Legion of Blood. I do get to take Black Knights as my battle line. So I've got two units of five of them. I've got two units of 20 Death Rattle Skeletons, and I've got a unit of 10 Dire Wolves. So battle line, nice and simple. Not much has changed with those, but it will become apparent as we go through the game. I then have two units of 20 Grave Guard. I alluded to one of them, but surprise, there's another unit of 20. Can't run them in a big brick of 30 because I'm not running them as battle line because I don't have a White King as a general. That is still a thing, but not today, not here. No thank you, sir and or madam. And then to round off the list, I took the purple sun of Shaiish because Shaiish and the purple sun is always fun. Purple fun. It's 1985, so I do not get to triumph, but that's fine because I will be triumphant on the battlefield, especially because my grand strategy is quite wild. I'm not sure how I feel about this because I'm looking at it going, this seems a bit much. It's called extend the corpse empires, raise the corpse empires. No, Empire of Corpses. I knew there was something to do with Empire and Corpses in there. And all this, ha all you have to do to achieve this is revive three units over the course of the entire game. Which is quite easy now. So I'll have my three victory points to begin with, basically. I mean, it will mean stuff dies, but they're already dead, so no big loss. Let's have a look at the battle plan. Today's battle plan is Position Over Power, a pitch battle from the General's Handbook. Four predetermined objective markers are placed onto the battlefield. At the start of the fourth battle round, the flank objectives are removed from play. Each player scores victory points at the end of each of their turns as follows. Score one victory point if you control at least one objective. Score one victory point if you control two or more objectives. Score one victory point if you control more objectives than your opponent. Score one victory point if you control any flank objectives with a friendly Galatian champion. Score two victory points if you complete the battle tactic you picked that turn. Each player also scores three victory points at the end of the battle if they completed their grand strategy. Well, well, well. Look at all this newness. Skeletons everywhere. Hey, yeah. I've got... Yeah, I've got skeletons. Skeletons, you've got skeletons. 
Is yeah. that the differentiation? Yeah, 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 yeah. Mine is a tub, yours is a bulb. Mine's a bulb, yeah. Okay. Um, so, couple of uh, little little things here. Um, because new army means new rules. Yeah. Um, although for the soul blight, a lot of it is the same, although slightly different. So I still have four grave sites, uh, which are marked out with our little tokens. Um, two of them still have to be within your territory. The other two are as normal. You can put them anywhere. You can still put stuff, the unquiet dead, into um, the grave. So I've got two black knights. Um, now, here's where it gets cool, because it's summonable units. Um, white kings are summonable now. That's cool. Which means you can revive them. No. Which is very Don't fun. Um, so I've got uh, White King and his Grave Guard, the Galatian Champion uh, detachment, are in the grave. Uh, I've got uh, the two Black Knights and the uh, White King on Mount, um, as well as a Purple Sun, just ready, ready to go. Um, you also realise that you did have points. I had points, so I put in the Soul Snare Shackles. So Soul Shackle Snares? Soul Snare Shackles. Soul Snare Shackles. Shackles. Yes. Soul shackles. Pairs. So I pop those in into my list as well because I can. Spirit Manacles. Spirit Manacles. Oh, no. No. Um, so <laughs> that's that. Um, and with my Doomed Minions command yes. trait, uh, so I got to, I basically, yeah, as I mentioned in my list, my general down here, if you're within three inches of her, um, it's twos to hit with my entire army D3 units that I get to pick, so of course I rolled a one. Because I want to show because, off cool things. Because it's not I, <laughs> um, I picked this unit of yeah. stalkers down here. So yeah, that's scary. Scary. Because you can't pick a monster or characters, but I think that's a very nifty trait. Yeah. And so, that's scary, so I understand doing this with them. Yes. And then there's not really anything to do pre-game for the Ossia, but there's some very exciting things when we get, get to the hero I get phase. Lots of stuff, but we'll talk about that when we get to it. Now, you finished a point first. Gift. What is this gift? You can go first. I see. Well, I, I feel like I'm about to sign a contract with the Ossia Bone Reapers, which is never a good idea. Nope. Mm -mm. Our ben pen is made of demon fingers. My priority. Yeah. So, I got two CP to start with. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I dropped oh. one. <laughs> Which just so happens to quite literally be uh, we don't um, have any more. So We're anticipating it. When, so, yeah. you have so many because Relentless Discipline is no longer a thing. No. So, I get like, all the normal command points that you get for playing the game normally. Yes. And then I get a cumulative amount based on how many friendly units I have on the field. And also you have Bone Reaper units. You don't yes. get it for allies, obviously. No, obviously. So, and you remember the numbers? Um, so you get one for uh, if you've got three or more units. Mm -hmm. You get two if you've got five or more units. Yep. And you get three if you've got seven or more yep. units. And you've got eight. And I do have eight. And, and because I'm incredibly uh, greedy and want more things all of the time, I also have a free one with Arkan for my heroic action. So the Ossiar Bone Reapers use normal command points now. Yes. They get access to redeploy and all that yep. defense and all that attack and all that kind of stuff. But as we well still as... have all of the Ossiar Bone Reapers ones. And we can still use them multiple times. Yeah, but only the Ossiar yes. ones. So you can't, can't be like... Like, all out defense, all out defense, all out defense, all out defense. I redeploy um, all of the time. And you are still um, bound by issuing one yes. and receiving one. The so same as normal. You just follow the normal rules, but you're basically, you're, yep. one of your battle traits is here's a list of ones that everyone can use, as well as whatever might be on your um, data scroll. Which data also scroll? makes it a little oh, bit more scroll. simple because I'm not having to think that I've got something different to other people, which was yeah. very confusing when everyone kept telling me, oh, you're going to redeploy there. And I was like, no, I can't. You can't. James, but now you can. This is what you did all the time to me, and it would confuse me. So this this is kind of like their, promise. their cool army yeah. rule is they've got lots of CP. Um, I did generate one with my Vampire Lord, my General, just because. And we've done some spells off camera. So, I managed to cast Soul Pike with my Vampire Lord Ooh. down here. Uh, now, incidentally, because I am a uh, Legion of Blood, I got a plus one to cast it because I'm more than three inches away. I cast it on a uh, 11, so I got plus one for 12. Arkans out of range yes. to deny anyway. Thankfully, because Arkham is still a bad man when it comes to wizardry. Um, now, because I cast it on an unmodified nine, it is unmodified. Um, I could pick two targets for Soul Pike. Alas, only one is in range, which is a pity. That. Ha! So I did it on this unit of Mortrek Guard here. Um, it may not come up, but just because it was cool, I wanted to cast a spell. Um, if they make a charge move, um, I roll a number of d6 equal to the charge the uh, charge roll, and for each four plus, I take a mortal wound. That is very cool. 
I did also cast down here with my Necromancer Mystic Shield upon my Grave Guard. I only cast it on a seven. Arkan is in range to deny. Arkan! Arkan deny denies it. it on an 11 because he still gets plus uh, two. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Fine. We've got one more spell to do, mm -hmm. which is with my Vampire Lord. She's got Spirit Gale. Ooh. With a plus one that does go off on an eight. Yes. Arkan is just out of range to deny. Mm -hmm. What Spirit Gale does, everything takes a mortal wound. If I cast it on an unmodified nine, unmodified, it would do it two mortal wounds, which is very cool. I um, have to roll my wards. You do have to roll your wards. We'll probably do that off camera. Yeah. Because this is, yeah, it's, so it's still a six up. Um, just my battle tactic to explain, it's expand the corpse empire. Um, I need to, <gasps> um, cool. I don't need to select any um, objectives here. I just need to be contesting at least two objectives that are outside of my territory with a summonable or vampire unit. It's almost like with my grave markers next to you two objectives, I done did the Tactics. plan. Tactics, it's like almost like our name, like that thing. Yeah, like that thing. Mm -hmm. um, I don't have anything else to do in my hero phase because the Locus of Shayish is still here. That will come up later. Um, let's do my movement. Skeletons! They're still quite slow. Four inch move, but I did run, so that's an eight. I'm not going that far, but for posterity. The Necromancer! Wait for me, my minions! And then the Dire Wolves just moving up behind the thing, maybe to feast on some bones. A much more mediocre one on the run over here, but that's okay. Vampire! Vampire! Graveguard! If someone could uh, custom make a um, Nicolas Cage vampire so that I could run around going, oh, I'm a vampire! Oh, I'm a vampire! That'd be great. Also, the new Renfield film looks amazing. It's um, Nicolas Cage as Dracula. I, oh, yeah. yes, please. Yeah. Oh, friends, friends. Oh, I did make space. Friends, yeah. More friends, friends. That's my battle tactic done. Yay. I love friends. That's my movement phase done. But it is now the charge phase. I have one charge to do with this front unit, the spear tip of these Black Knights. Now, because they're wholly within 12 of a White King on Skeletal Steed, uh, his new rule, Lord of Trampling Bones, uh, allows me to re-roll charge rolls if they're wholly within 12, which is very nice indeed. I'll, Good job I'll too. utilize that ability right now. Oh, I miss out oh. by one. That's a shame, because they did their, their mortal wounds has changed on the charge. Okay. Never mind, that's the end of my turn. I have picked up my battle tactic, because I'm holding two objectives outside of my uh, zone with um, summonable units, um, and I'm holding one, holding two, holding four. Go me. Great start with a new book. Well done. We're in my turn. Mm. And I've gone with the battle tactic, which is kind of the same as is in the old book, because you stick with what you know. Top tip. Okay. Trample the Defiant. Oh. So I have to charge you and be within three inches of an enemy unit at the end of the... It is identical. Yeah, yeah. it's literally It's still the same. only the Kavalos, right? Yes, cool. yes it is. It is the exact same. I did um, Arkan's power to... I healed up the Kavalos Death Riders, my Gothasar Harvester, and I bought back a Mortec Guard, oh. and I've done Heroic Recovery on himself, so he's healed. So the only thing that is wounded currently is one Stalker. Yes, yes. yeah, Ar Arkan basically does... He still works the same way, although, if it comes up, it's quite gnarly because rather than um, healing a unit yeah. for free, you can go, oh no, one of my stalkers is dead. On a free plus, he stands back up. Oh, I'm sorry, what now? Yeah. That's brilliant. brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Uh, your heroic action. Um, I have done Immortal Majesty, uh, which is a Legion of Blood specific one. Uh, effectively, if you are within 12 inches, I think it's just within 12. It might be wholly within, but I'll check. This is just because I don't really need an extra CP this turn. This is just for funsies. Um, if you want to do all out defense or inspiring presence whilst you're within 12 inches of her, um, it costs you two CP. That's I know cool. you I have, have a loads. This is to represent the extra one I would have gotten for the turn, but we don't have enough. I understand. Um, we oh. literally don't have enough. <gasps> Thank you. It's because I've got them as grave sites. You oh, because he's stealing um, them. Yeah, it, it may not come up, but I don't need an extra CP and I thought it'd be fun to sort of explain. Yes. Now for that, my magic. So you are in range with everything to deny, so 
Yes. That is a thing. Although Arkans plus six inch range is now just always on. Yeah, it's just always on. Which is great. <laughs> I mean, you, you were it was basically yeah. always on anyway, because you'd always go, I'll spend his free relentless yeah. discipline to do it. <laughs> but what I've managed to do is I've empowered the Naderite blade weapons down here. So the exploding sixes will now go off on fives. Exploding fives. Exploding fives. You've got an sixes. army of exploding sixes again. Are you happy? I'm so happy. Okay. It's why the dice it's why the dice like it because they're magma dice and they explode and it's fire everywhere i've also managed to cast drain vitality onto your horsemen down uh. there so they are minus one to hit and minus one to their save yes which is uh, the stings but we've saved the cool thing for last of course which is curse of years because yes. why wouldn't i do curse of years because it's hilarious well that goes off in an eight okay um i am in range to uh unbind this. with all of them uh, this is with my classic army and over here um because she's three inches away i do get the plus one no, not enough, because Arkan has plus two. Well, I've Bum. got my dice here already. This is going on your wolfies. My wolves? Any sixes? I don't Last know. time I tried Curse of Years, I rolled no sixes. I rolled no sixes. <laughs> this is boring. It's really sad when it doesn't really go Really sad. <laughs> We're in the mover phase, and I am going to do the classic Bone Reaper thing of adding three inches to the move of this unit, because my battle tactic is to make a charge and then still be in range. So I need that to happen to get points. This squad of Mortec Guard have just run, so they're just coming up to here. Skeleton Carnifex is going to move forward and he's going to shoot bones at the Skelling Tubs. Give me back my skulls! That's what I'm trying to do. Thank you. You're welcome. I rolled a six on the run for these Mortec Guard, so they're just going to come up here. This squad of Mortec Guard are just moving. And the stalkers are just going to fan up to here. These stalkers are just going to move up so they have more chance to do something in the next turn. And Arkin is going to very wobbly whoosh, 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 to here. Are you ready for skulls? Give me back my skulls! You ready for femurs? Ooh. And I'll take a tibia. You know, I could, do, I, could, I, 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 could, I could do with some new knees. Okay. Um, my Gothasar Harvester is going to shoot at your skelly tubs. Okay. Freeze and freeze. Ooh, I hit you three times. Freeze. I wound you twice. Minus uh, one. Minus one. Six up save. Die! A, a six up ward. Die! I'm, I'm dead again. Yes. Join. Uh, can I... Can I... No. Can I gather up your... No, no, because they will revive in the combat phase. Nope, I will gather them. No, there, there's a nope. lot of reviving that's going to happen in this game. Nope. <laughs> it could get quite crazy. Oh. The Mortec Crawler, which is a little simpler to use now. It's very, 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 very nice for me. So I am going to give it all out attack from Arkan. Because I want to attack you. And, you, and because you're allowed to do that Yay! now. Yay! Hooray. Yeah. Um, I'm going for the mid... So, yeah, one. I can't remember which. I is it the remember. cauldron, the skulls, and the steely? So they're all... Yes, you can all the, cool, uh, the skulls I'm going for. Yeah, so you can skulls. use all of the profiles now. You pick one when you fire. Yeah. Um, they're not like once per game. They all have differing rages and stat lines. They're just a basic attack yes. now. And they don't change based on your own degradation, which no. just makes it a bit simpler in my own So what box. does this one do? The so necrotic skulls? So this will be skulls. hitting on twos because my will out attack, wounding on threes, minus one round damage two. Okay. And then my Mortec Crawler also has the effect of if I've targeted you, I can roll the dice and on a five up, you have fight last. If I've targeted the same unit with all of my attacks, I get to add one or two, two to the roll. To the roll. Yeah, so because, because somehow you can right fire off, off yeah. a catapult and multiple things. I, I am doing all that defense here because of your drain vitality, otherwise I won't get a save. Catapult into your horsey. Okay. Well, I hit you all the time. Good thing you did all that attack. Yeah. I wound you twice. Okay. Uh, six up saves here. Damage two, you say? Yes. Award save. Deathless minions. Ooh. Ooh. You take two damage. Uh, so one dies. Do I give you fight last? Nah. No. But I, th that's, that would have been nice, but fine. I guess I can't have everything. No. Charge phase then. Mm. Can I get my battle tactic? Oh. Yes, with a 10. Uh, so the horses will move in a moment. But first of all, first of all, second of all, I'll go with the Mortec Guard mm. also doing a charge. Oh, they're Ooh. in. Okay. 10. So. Just before we um, move these guys in, yes. because the Death Rider Wedge is still a command ability, yep. but it's no longer required to be used no. to do the mortal wounds on the charge, which are much better now, because you rolled a 10 on that charge. Yes. So you rolled 10d6, and for each 5 plus you do a mortal ah. wound. One, two, so the Cavalos are quite 3, 4, 5, nifty. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 
I do much the same with my black knight, but I failed the charge. Ooh. Oh, on that... a five up or six up? Uh, five up. Models. Okay, well, uh, that's that? six. Six! Ward saves on my grave guard. Ah, I'm dropping dice Goodbye. all over the place. I ward one of them. Okay, five up. Five go scoblet. Ouch. Why not? I can I can move because I got a ten inch charge with the Mortec Guard. Um, I can move out of the way of the Stalkers. Mm. Use an eight. Seven. I'll re-roll it. You can. You're allowed to now. It costs you a CP, not? but you've got several. No. Nice. Oh, that was quite nice. lucky for me. I'll start with my cavalry step right. Mm. I have sixteen attacks with the Naderite blades, mm. exploding on fives. Because of your empowered yes. thing. I, I'm doing all out defense because I'm... I'd like a safe. Yes. Okay, quite a few fives and sixes. Did I say threes and fours or fours and threes? Uh, it's threes and fours, threes I think and fours, it was. Yes. That sounds right. One, two, three, four, five. Explodes. Oh, you need one more dice. Oh. What a shame. So sad. Fours to win you. Fours to win me, yes. Hopefully, I can get a similar roll again because that's quite good. Mm, okay, that's that's not great. Five. Six? Two, four, six, up, minus one round. Okay. Uh, so five ups because of all out defense. Yes. Right, it's not worth the CP. <laughs> Deathless minions! I do shrug one, okay. so you kill three, three more. there. And then I've got my hoofs and tiffs. Oh, hoofs oh, and, and tiffs. Hoofs and tiffs. Uh, these do not get the explodey. Yeah, so the Nanorite weapons is now an army-wide ability. They get it on all their melee attacks, uh, unless they're a mount. So Oops. that's nice for things like Stalkers, Immortus Guard, so be the Archive. Three no rend. Three no rend. Three no rend. Four plus! Ooh. Come on now. Deathless minions! I do ward one. Okay. So that is another five in total slain. Right. I have ten remaining. Please don't kill me. Oh, I will. I'm attacking with my black knights. I'm going to spend a command point on impenetrable ranks. What does this do? This is one of my Aussie art commands. I get plus one to my ward save. So they have a five up ward now. That's quite nice. And yes. I can do it over there as well. Because, because it's, it's an, an Aussie, Aussie art command. Art command. Um, so you could have done shield wall. Yes. Which is their de yep. de de battle scroll... <sighs> Unit of command ability, um, but it's not reroll saves anymore. No. It is uh, ignore, ignore modifiers, and because modifiers. you don't have any rend, it will do absolutely yeah. nothing. Um, but that is positive modifiers as well. Um, exactly. So, so not so good if you're you've got a mystic shield yeah. up. Um, but good, like you know, it means you have to balance those sort of yeah. things. But it's also a five up ward is molto bene. Um, I did my horses off camera, nothing happened. The lances, oh, oh, that's good. But it's fine, the, the wound rolls on. Freeze to wound. Correct. I told you. Uh, four up, uh, these are all damage one. Is that how many? Uh, three. Three. Four ups. Ding, ding, ding. Save them all. Oh, very nice. Because I'm a legend. I'll strike you back then. Yeah, yeah. We, we forgot about the drain vitality doing yeah, minus one to but hit. But it didn't matter. Didn't matter. I told you. Um, I also forgot to roll for my deathless legions over here. I brought one back because you still do that at the start of any fight phase and on a four plus the skeleton comes back, which is very nice indeed. Well, I get all of my hits back because you didn't kill a single one. Correct. Threes and fours exploding sixes. It's not bad. If I had the exploding fives on that unit, mm. um, I do get three explodes. Mm. If I had the exploding fives on that unit, that would have been horrendous. Mm. Force to wound you. I don't think you're going to need it. No? Well, it's only force to wound, but I don't get safe here because of drain vitality. Yes. And you're uh, built in minus one. Oh, that's quite good. That is quite. That's quite good. Quite. That is two, four, that's quite six, good. eight, ten. 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 So I need to roll at least three sixes here. Otherwise, yes. the unit is wiped. That would be nice. Ugh, I rolled one. Oh. The unit's dead. For now. Goodbye, horses. For now. For, no. for now. They could join my ranks. For now. I could build them into better skeleton forms. Leave my horses alone. I can make them better, Chef. The Grave Guard. Impenetrable ranks. I understand. Yeah. Okay. Here we go. Um, fun fact. Uh, these guys now have a two-inch range. Uh, with, the horrifying. Great, with the great blades, which is quite nasty. Um, it was quite easy to attack in multiple ranks anyway, but now you've got a lot more room and Don't like it. Um, and it does make sense. Yeah. It sticks are quite They're mahoosive. Uh, it still falls to hit with the great blades. I'm also on a horse, so I'm quite nimble. Mm. Not the best. That's not that's okay. that bad for it's, hitting on uh, fours. Yeah, that's right, actually. Yeah, that's all right. Uh, it's freeze to wound. Bip. 
and six is to wound, do a mortal wound in, in addition. addition. Um, you're doing a five up ward again? Yes, the impenetrable ranks. Because it's an Ossiarch command, you're so allowed to... So I can to do it all the time! Double dip! Uh, okay, not bad. Right. So that is six. Uh, six at minus one. So I'll have five ups here. Okay. okay. These um, are two damage pops. And still. then there's two mortals. Two mortal wounds on top. top. That is so. eight damage total because they are two damage each. They're two damage. Mm, they're quite chonky. There we go. Five ups. I've got three wounds on these now. I think they always did have three yes. wounds. Okay. Uh, I didn't come up there. Have killed. So you've killed two. Two of them. Three remain. Three remain. But now it is time for crap. Krell, the Mortark of Despair. Oh. Back in the day. Back in the day. Um, now, it's worth pointing out that uh, the Lord of uh, Shambling Bones is his uh, <laughs> ability, but he can only do that in my hero phase, um, which he couldn't do because he was in the grave. He was yeah. waiting for his time to strike. Yeah. Um, it's very good, though, because it's sixes to hit explode for grave cards. Can we not be friends if he's the Lord of Shambling Bones? I have loads of bones. Yeah. No. Oh. I've got five attacks. I'm hitting on freeze, wounding on freeze, minus one damage two, but six is a hit, do two mortal wounds in addition. I'm not gonna roll any sixes. I roll one. So you, there are two mortal wounds in addition. In addition to my normal damage. I will pop that down here. It's only two extra wounds, um, but they are at minus one and two damage. Five ups. Okay, so that's six damage total from Krell, the Mortark of Despair. But I will survive. Uh, you yes. you do completely keep one alive, which is very nice because you got it on fives. Yeah, because uh, so I've got I've got two left. Good. I get my battle pack again. Damn it. Battle shock. No, spending no? a CP okay. to auto pass it. Um, I don't need to because I don't care. So now I've just got five command points sitting here doing nothing. They don't carry over. <laughs> Can carry over. No, you don't need them to carry over. Oh. Um, okay, cool. So you did, did you get my battle tactic. You did get the battle tactic because you are. I am done. I'm still alive. That's all I needed them for. They can they can die next time. I'm only getting the one on the primary because yes. I'm slow and your things are scary and hard to kill. So yeah, but um, I'm playing the long game, I guess. I guess so. Uh, also forgot to mention last turn, and um, you'll have seen it pop up correctly on the victory point tracker. Um, I got an extra one uh, because in this mission you get an extra one if a Galatian yes. champion is holding the flank objectives. I have no Galatian champions because we don't own any for the Aussie Art Bone Reapers. Fletcher! So your fault, Fletcher. Stop painting space wolves! Wolf! Oh, woo. Priority time. Oh, oh me? Uh, it's a free. It's a reasonable number. Oh, bum. I will probably take that. No, Priority. I yeah. Well, yes, I have taken the priority. Because, of course. Yes. Um, I still have loads of command points. I've got eight, eight this turn. Um, and I will be desecrating your land because I can't really get any of the Osseoc Bone Reaper ones this turn uh, just with what I've got available and what you've got on your uh, side of the table in terms mm. of units. Because I need to like kill whole things, which is going to be difficult this turn. Um, I need to clear out some of the ranks. So desecrate their land, it will. I, I did attempt to get an extra command point with Arkan and I failed, which is fine. Yeah, you've still got eight seats. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, two things of note. You'll notice I didn't roll for um, the reviving of this unit here for the Endless Legions. It's because it happens in the movement phase now mm. rather than the battle shock. We'll come back to that. What I am going to do for my heroic action is strike at an opening. I, I will do impenetrable... Ranks? What's my call? Yeah. Because it's when I'm selected as the target of an attack, not in the shooting or fight phase. Yeah. So things like all out defense, all out attack, you can't normally do here, but that you can, which is very nifty. Because I'm a also a bone reaper and I'm the best. Well, I do miss three attacks, but I have done two mortal wounds hey. regardless. And I oh no, I've only Just done two, two mortal, mortal wounds. wounds. So I won't even up. kill one. Oh, you take bam. one wound off of one. Well, I tried. We will continue. For what it's worth, I've healed my stalkers. So yep. they're all healthy. I can't kill the horse because it's too far away. Just out of range. Too far away. Um, now I could choose to fall back and then heal in the movement phase if you I could. wanted to. Yep. But we'll see if I choose to do that. Yeah. For now, I have empowered the Nadarite weapons of my stalkers and also given them a mystic shield because I want them to yeah. do something cool. Uh, the, the, the necromancer completely whiffed on the mystic shield. Yep. Uh, I managed to roll a nine to unbind with my Lamian with the plus one. But you cast it on a nine yeah. because of your plus two. Yeah. It's very sad. Because plus two beats plus one. Correct. Every time. I'm now going to attempt Curse of Years because it's funny. I understand. Uh, that would be plus a two, seven. five, six, seven. My general. Please don't deny it. I wanted to do something this turn. With a plus one, Ow! yes! <laughs> I mean, I didn't need it. Nope. That's fine. Can we just roll the dice anyway to see if... 
Oh, see. I would have gotten four see, sixes. See, you shouldn't then, have rolled and then, it. And then. I would have just been. You four, still would have killed four. Uh, well, maybe. Yes, I have. Yes. Regardless, you shouldn't have done it. If I don't do anything with Curse of Years this game, I'm going to be incredibly upset and I will make it your problem. Given the stalkers an extra three inches to their movement. Yeet! Speedy. Now, you could also have spent one in the hero face to give them run and charge, yeah. but you didn't, re you didn't really. I mean, to. this squad water guard are just going to go, hi. Hello. Also worth pointing out that you did try and do the punishment yes. of death. Um, I uh, I rolled a one. Yeah. That's what I get for forgetting to do it in the actual hero phase. Yeah. That's your punishment. Hey. Yeah, nice one, endless spell. Beep, beep, beep. Yes. The stalkers have spent a, a command point for the extra three inches of movement once more. And for what it's worth, I will be spending a command point, and obviously a command point for these to fall back and still charge. So a few mortal wounds. I have run with these Mortec Guard and just, oh, I'm also taking my Bone Tide Nexus with me. Coming over here. And this squad of Mortec Guard are just going to slowly trundle forwards. I might redeploy. Oh, you can if you want, you coward. Yes, I am going to redeploy with the skeletons. We'll see what we get. A five. I need to take. Oh, first of I was excited. At first, you, he, he uh, no, he at first you said you were a coward. So at I was first a coward. I called you a coward, yeah. then you said you were going to move forward, and I got excited because yay, fight, and then... Because um, you want to desecrate the land, so yeah. you best do a lot of damage. I will. It's me. Oh, Not wow. like a tank. <laughs> Tonga tronk. <laughs> Tongasaurus, man. Wow. You know what else is Tongasaurus? Those new Seraphon models. Ooh. I will desecrate this skull also, help me. Oh my goodness, the Gothasar Harvest is gonna harvest that skull. It is now the end of your movement phase, which means it's time to bring forth the Endless Legion. So, this has changed slightly. It's now, at the end of every movement phase, you roll a d6 and you get plus one if it's your turn. And just on a four plus, so a three plus in your turn, you bring one, back, uh, bring one of your summonable units back that is um, been destroyed. You can't do it more than once per game. Half models, rounding up, or with free wounds remaining if they're a character, because you can revive white kings now, which mm -hmm. is very cool. So, let's see if they come back. No, on a two plus, they do not. I'm I'll, happy I'll, with that. I'll explain it to you now, just because it's fine. So, holy within 12 of a character or a gravesite, you can't pile in or charge that turn. So you can't use it for sneaky, oh, I've arrived in my turn, I'm going to charge you. But what you can do is go, yeah, I'm just over three inches away. You're because such a troll. That would be really good for the move blocking for the charges. Um, but I rolled a two, so it's not going to happen. But just so you know, that was the plan. I can, of course, try again next turn, but not this turn. I'm clearly the superior skeleton. We're in the shooting phase. I did the Gothasa Harvester on camera because I killed two skelly tubs. Two skelly bobs got hit in the noggin with a skull. They went, Clive! And he's just like, hello, mate. How's it going? It's like, you just killed me. So it's like they're just two skulls <laughs> lying on the floor like this in the desert going like, yeah, sorry about that. All right, right, mate, I haven't seen you in years. I, of course you haven't seen me. We ain't got eyeballs. Oh! <laughs> Your uh, catapult? Yeah, necrotic skulls going into wolves. Um, I'm all out attacking from Arkham. Yes, he is in wrong. So it'll be... Oh no, it's a double one. Well, it, at least I did. You did hit twice though. Hit twice because of uh, all out attack. Yes. Oh, with one wound. Uh, mine also. One. Uh, two damage then. Yeah. Do I kill a wolf? No. Oh, I don't even kill a wolf. Not a single, not a single wolf. -er. I was the That will please Fletcher. The whole time. Charge phase, and I'm going to begin with my Cavalos Death Riders because uh, I, I can charge with them. I spent the command point, and also I want to do my mortal wounds, so that's what I'm going to do. Mortal wounds are fun. Ooh, seven. Okay, so I'm just going to just quickly do you this. You go smack. Go because I can. One, two, seven. Three, four, five, six, seven. Now, interestingly, I could have also spent a command point to be able to heal them up because you can now um, fall back and heal because it's yeah, at the end of the movement phase. Yeah, but then phase. you wouldn't be able to charge because yeah. even though you can do multiple Ossiarch commands, you are still limited by issuing one and receiving one. It's just the two this time. Just the two. Just the two. Just the two. Oh. Just the one. Okay, but it is one. Just the so one. Go away. Into my death pile. Leave. Get out. Right, right now. now. It's the end of you and me. <laughs> Everything else. Mm. Stalkers. 
My uh, goodness. Give a nine. I'm just going to put them next to them so I know what everything's rolled mm. so I can move them afterwards. More tech guard. Oh, a nine. So interestingly, your soul plaque, is it unmodified? I will have to check because that. Because obviously You've they got the get plus one. We'll, we'll do that in a minute. We'll do that in, we'll a, do minute, that in a minute, but I'll keep the unmodified roll there. Cool. The stalker's down here. Ah! Oh my goodness, everything's so angry! Wherever they want, I suppose. They can't um, charge they ran. they ran, yep. but the other Mortec can't. A three... Won't make won't it, because you have to be free. Yep. Oh no, you, it will make it, because you're so you the charge. Plus charge. Yep. I've checked Soul Pike, hmm. and it specifically states that it's on the charge roll, not, not unmodified. unmodified. So ten? Four pluses! You impale yourself! Oh, Ooh. I really want to... Oh, oh. six. Oh no. Six mortal wounds. You do get a six up ward. I've been impaled. <laughs> um, you don't get to do your five up ward because no. it's not an attack. Ooh, a kill five. five. Ooh. <laughs> ah, and just like this. Oh no. Me sad. Yeah. Um, and then that's it for charges. That's it for charges because okay. they can't. Um, and I, yeah. Yeah. Okay, yeah. I'll just do a few little bits of admin now because these technically happen at the start of the fight phase. Um, combat phase. Um, Crimson Feast from my vampire mm -hmm. onto you. Crimson Feast from my vampire onto mm -hmm. thee. Um, and then I'm also going to roll for my Deathless Legions. I bring back two of them. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> You're about to be more impaled. Weirdered. I'm going to start with the stalkers over here because I want to show off the stalkers because they're cool. I understand. Yeah. And I'm going with the precision face, so plus one damage. Shink. Yeah. Plus one damage. No longer plus one uh, rend, but they basically have They're that They're rend two now. anyway. Which is tasty. So I'll start with my falchions. Are you doing anything over here? Are you doing anything? Great. I have explaining sixes and I have high damage. I've only got nine models. I'm not, no, I'm not doing it. I am doing all out defense just in case. Right, I'll start with my falchions. So these will be threes and threes. Exploding hmm. six means I hit you all the time. Okay. One wound, minus two. Minus two, a six up save. Yes, okay. it's paid off. The spirit blades. Okay. Well, I missed you once, but I get Always three. <laughs> I've, got, I've got eight attacks, that's 10 hits. Why? Uh. Why do we allow Katie to play with armies that get exploding sixes? Okay. That is two, four, six at minus two. Six at minus two, six, six up saves. Two six up saves. It's still uh, two damage. There's still a lot of damage. Yes. Uh, so this is eight. Yes. The unit will live. Just. Bless you, uh, Emma Skull. <laughs> Thank you. You didn't hear that. <laughs> that is. Uh, it's not quite as aggressive as my sneeze, yeah. but it will still hurt. I'm trying Goodbye. to hold the man. Oh, I shrug another two, but that is yes. six dead. Six. Ouch. You've got three left. Yeah, that's sad. Skeletons. Yeah. Not to be confused with pelotons. <laughs> um, I've piled in. What are you doing with that dice? Well, I've got 35 there. attacks. That's in range. Um, in the interest of trying to kill at least one mm -hmm. of these guys, um, I am using my last CP on all out to tick. I have all out defense and they do have mystic shield on. So it will be threes to save and my six up. Yes. Um, yes, because the heroic action that I did last turn for the you can't, it will cost you two CP won't apply here because it's a new, it's a new yeah. hero phase because that's from hero phase to the end of the turn. Right. Because otherwise, if it was until your next hero phase, that would be pretty wild. Mm. I will double check it, but double it won't check. matter. So basically, freeze, 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 six. Yeah, easy, easy to remember. Right. Get out of my way, chair. Good lord. Right, that's quite a lot of misses there. Let me help. I'll take the ones on this end. You, you hang, hang out over there. Thank you. Oh, that's not. That's you. not great. That's not okay. great. For freeze. There we go. I realised that that would have ended in disaster there, because I nearly okay. went them on the floor. Oh, 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 yep. Yeah. Got it. Put the pouch back on. Yeah, pou pouch has been reattached. Okay. Never leave home without your pouch, friends. Freeze to wound. Now, the reason why it's free up save is because you have a four up save, you did get Mystic Shield on, but because yep. I outnumber you with that, I think it's yep, Legion, Legion of Skeletons or Legion of Bone and Death. But um, we're skeletons together. Um, I get you get plus one rend, which is cool. It's come back round. Let's turn around. It's come back round. Okay. Everything's coming up, Chef. Maybe. Ah! That is a total of six, 11 saves. 11 Three saves. If, you could, if I could kill one. Oh, that's a good roll. That's a really good roll. Only two. <laughs> Can only I shrug two. them? Only two. I take two It's only two. Not good. Not good. Very, very bad. Sorry. All right. I'm going to spend a command point on all-out attack with my Mortec Guard down here. 
Mmm. I'm gonna try and kill you. Absolutely. What, what are you attacking? Oh, into your um I forgot he wasn't part of the unit. I would yeah. have kind of gone like sure. that. So everything will go into him. Everything into into the into black the I understand. So this will be twos and fours here because my all attack. Exploding sixes, naturally. I miss you once and I one, two, three, four, five, sixes. Ooh. Why though? <laughs> I Ooh. like it where they give me armies with explosions. Alright. <laughs> nope. And it's always a it's always a spike when I play against you as well, so you get the worst of me. Fours. It is balanced out by them winning on fours, but that's still a very good roll. It is a good roll. It's a very good roll. That is good. Uh, so that'll be two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. 14 at minus one red. 14! 14 whole wounds. 14 entire wounds. Four, right. two times seven. Sixes. Half of 28. I do save three of okay. them. Okay. And then your... Horde saves. Horde saves. Ward. I need to pass two of these, otherwise the unit is whipped. Ward. They got wh They will get whipped out. No, I don't pass a single one. Instead They're dead. Of, instead of that being a ward save, it's more of an... Whip orc save. Ward what? save. Awkward. Awkward. I thought you said orc, and I was like, there's no orcs here, any skeletons. James counts. He's an orc. That was awkward. Skeletons over here. Now, I know I keep forgetting about my standard bearers. They still give you reroll ones to ward save. I don't think I've been rolling many on the ward saves. Forgive me. He is but a simple man. I did but a simple man with literally every single yes. army in the game bouncing around my noggin. There's a reason we call you the Oracle. This many attacks. Into the Mortec Guard. You're not doing any... Mm, no, great. because I just kind of feel like I'm dead and I don't want to waste the CP. Yeah, I understand. Uh, hitting on fours. Fours, I'll help you take out your misses then. They're not the best, but they are quite cheap. So it's yeah. not so bad. You get gift. Thank you. It is freeze to wound though, which yeah. is quite nice. Doing and I outnumber you quite significantly. Yeah. So... Minus one rend. Mm, not great, not the worst, not the best. So uh, seven. Seven, fives, and sixes. You're not doing the five at ward, so that's good for me. Seven. Quarter of 20. Fives. I save two, and then sixes. Do I kill the unit? I do. Yes, you do, exactly. Perfectly. Please, please, please. Yeah. Okay. No. Well, I've done my, my horses off camera because you kind of know what they're doing. You already. know what they're doing now. You did two wounds with the horse boys, and then three wounds with the riders. Yes. Uh, four ups against the horsies. Okay, so that's one ward save to make. I'll do that in a moment. And then Still the blades, one. minus one, five ups. Okay. So it's four ward saves. You four need ward to do. saves, a six up. I'm going to remember you to reroll re my your ones. ones, Chef. It doesn't matter, they're dead. Yeah. Again. Super dead. Soup. Goodbye. Squish. I don't think. Skeleton. Into my pile of reviving. I don't think skeleton squish. Not Manfred has attacked. Um. <laughs> A horse did nothing. Yeah, it's a horse. But the cursed lance. The horse is a bit encumbered by its... Uh, does hit you twice. He doesn't do any wound. mortal wounds or anything Good. like that because he only does mortal wounds on the charge because he's a knight. That's what he should do. Uh, it is freeze to wound you. Oh, bum. Uh, one at minus one. Five up. Damage two, and then though. six up. I do ching, ching. Two. Two. Fine. All right, I'll take that. The other stalkers? Mm. Yeah. So, uh, to note, these also did have the precision aspect, so the plus one damage, and they do have the um, empowered Nadarite weapons. So, yeah. fives and sixes explode. I will start with the falchions. Okay. Oh, thank you. Just the one here. <sighs> it is, it a, is a wound. Okay. I'm not getting any saves here. Three. I'm just going to do all my ward saves at once. Yep. Free in the pool. The spirit blades. The pool of death. Okay. One miss, but I do, do get two explodies. It could have been a lot worse. So much worse. So it's much rolling worse. It's th this is still not bueno for me. Okay. All right. That is one, two, three, four, five, ten more. Words. Thirteen. Oh. Yes. That could have been a lot so worse. So much worse. Like a lot. They will live. Right. They will live from a certain point of view because they're already dead. You see. Yeah. Right. Ward saves. We roll the ones. No. Kind of a meaningless ability, really. Um, eleven die. That's nice. Again, Krell, the Mortark of Despair. Yes. Oh no! He has piled in, and he oh, will attack no. your horse boys because. Sorry, he's going to do one wound again. Well, it's two mortal wounds and four hits. Two mortal wounds. Yes. And two wounds minus one. Two wounds minus one. So I do the saves. Fives. Six so, damage total. One, two. Oh, goodbye, dice. Almost exactly. Oh, it's there. 
that jester because you did the mortal wound before. Cleave! Oh, he cleave. Oh, look at that. Badass. Battle shock. Krell doesn't care. All of his friends, however, are dead, so he is slightly upset about that. Yeah, I understand. Because he's the mortal of despair. Yeah. He's sad. Skelly Bob's down here. Um, I've lost 11, so it'll be 1 plus my d6. Okay, so 2 That's... flee. They don't okay. flee. That they be so much worse. Dissolve into necromantic goo. Ooh, gross. Um, they Absolutely will. Disgusting. They will, of course, be back because that's how the legions work. For what it's worth, um, I am holding one, two, and more. Um, yes. I don't get my battle tactic because I was greedy and wanting to charge things. Well, look, I understand, and also it doesn't really matter for your grand strategy. Because... No, because all I care about is is the Osiot Bone Reapers one. So I did it tactically on purpose because the normal ones. Mine. Tactically on purpose. Well, I don't care. Nice. You've okay. got a turn now, though. Thank you. My turn two. Heroic action-wise, I have done two heroic actions with my general because she is a Galatian champion. What? I tried to get a CP. Alas, no bueno. But I have done Immortal Majesty again. And I did check. It is within 12. Not wholly within 12. Ooh. So if you want to do all out defense or inspiring presence, not that you need to, um, it'll cost you two CP. Boo! You know, I also tried uh, to get Quite literally point. boo! Yeah, wow. I tried to get a command point and I couldn't. You didn't. Mm -mm. Okay. Uh, for my battle tactic, I've taken Endless Nightmare. <laughs> um, so I pick one summonable unit on the battlefield, this unit here. If I can bring back six or more models this turn, I get it. Yay. Which seems quite That's good quite given cool. that skeletons revive at the start of the combat phase on a four plus. Speaking of revives, the, loc uh, the Locus of Shaiish, I can't remember what it's called. Invocation of Death. Um, I pick basically units that are wholly within 12 of characters. What? Each character can pick up to three, and I bring back models or heal models, which are summonable. So actually, if he was wounded, I could heal up to three wounds That's on him. Cool. So it's actually quite. Wounded, the White Kings get quite beefy. I don't like it. I'm going to heal my wolf. Yes. Wolf. wolf. I bring back this Skelly Bob over here. Yes. And I bring back three models over here with these Skelly Bobs. Yay. So. You just need to bring back three more. Three more. Pop that over there. Spell-wise, Mystic Shield went off. Yeah, wasn't you, you were rolling high. Waste Away went off. And I rolled a nine on the unmodified roll, so I got to pick two units because that also went off. So the Stalkers are now minus one to wound and damage. No, thank you. <laughs> and these guys are minus one to wound and damage to a minimum of, of one, obviously, guys. Um, only on melee attacks, but quite nifty. We're now going to cast Spirit Gale once again. It goes off on an 11 with my plus one. And because I cast it on a double five, oh. that applies twice. Ah. So every enemy unit on the field takes two mortal wounds, which is bonkers. Um, we'll save well, you time I'll and roll the ward saves off camera because we'll just be here for a while. Yep. But we'll let you know what happens. The skeletons move four inches. Mighty are thee. <laughs> Send forth the hoons. They have to go like this because of the, the nature of uh, the three inches, so that's that's why they're like that. Okay. The vampire is moving up to here. And the grave guard moving up to here. I'll actually measure that and just make sure that is four inches because I want to be charging. Oh, back I go. That was cheating. That's better. The vampire lord does have fly, so she just pops over to here. And the necromancer just moving. End of the movement phase. We're going to roll for my endless legion. Please don't bring things. Do back. I bring back my grave guard? Oh come on now! It teetered towards the free. That's very sad. Charge phase. Yes. Wolf. No. The five. That's fine. Where are they going? Wolf. That way. Wolf. 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 Um, are you Fletcher. Wolf. 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 Uh, let's do these skeletons down here. Not what I wanted, so I just won't move. You won't move? Nope. I mean... I don't want to. <laughs> no, no thank you. Come play with the puppy. Don't want to. He wants to play with no. you. No. The Grave Guard. Well, that becomes a six with their banner. Banner? Musician. Um, do, 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 that do, do, do. One... Except it's more like, because no lungs. It will make it, but it's not getting a lot. Oh, I do have a two hit. Let me do some measurements. <laughs> right, it will make me in. Make me in? Get me in. Um, <laughs> sure. Uh, but it won't be very good. So I am spending a CP to re-roll it. 
because it can't be that's Bingo. much better because it could literally could have been worse um, almost double the vampire lord requires quite a large charge because she can fly so button and charge misses charge yes a nine i don't think quite does it it was you more like a all the way ten. over yeah and I, my base isn't big enough to go here no you could get oh, to there which is not it's going to range. work because i need to finish the move that's fine she'll just stay as she is so just before we go into anything else we're going to roll for my endless legion don't bring the map I bring back lots of oh, them. Oh, they're fours? Oh. I bring back seven of them, Woo. thus achieving my battle tactic. I have started with the Grave Guards. Mm -hmm. I have given them Crimson Feast. I had 48 attacks because of the two inch range, which is very tasty indeed. Yeah. Um, I only hit with 19 though, Ooh. which is less than Bueno. Yeah, um, for what it's worth, I did spend a command point for, to get the five at ward. I would have all out defense, but it would have cost two CP. Immortal Majesty. So, I didn't do that. So, 19 wounds. Mm -hmm. 19 hits, rather. Uh, so, that's three mortal wounds in a dish. So, I just pop that to um, the side. It did. That's come around a, a reasonable amount, okay. actually. I only dropped six there. So, that's 13 saves of five up and three mortal wounds on top. These are two damage a pop. So, Ow, you know, I just punched the even though you only hit with 19, you still have a very, very high wound potential. Five ups. Oh, it's not bad. It's not shabby. It's not bad. It isn't bad. Um, so I fell six. So, so there's 12, 12, 12, 13, 14, 15. 15. So I could kill the unit, but you'd have 16. to roll quite badly. You've got 11 wounds remaining Five in there in total. Okay, the five ups helped a little. Mm. So that kills the one that was, yep. and then. So you're wounded. Kills another. One is dead. And one has taken three wounds. One has two wounds remaining. I will fight back with him into the scaling tubs. Now, um, I remembered I have Mystic Shield on him, so I would have been saving on fours. I went back, looked at it, re-rolled. He's healthy. Yeah, he's, after the ward saves yeah. and whatnot, he's basically took two wounds less. And I've obviously gone for precision, so plus one damage on him. This Just... is into my death rattles. Yes. Yes. Threes and threes. I hate you all the time because of the explosions. Right. <laughs> um, I don't know why I'm rolling four dice, because... Um, I only have three attacks with him because he's a fashion, so I'll just re-roll the wounds again. Sure. Because I hit you all the yeah. time. Anyway. Three wounds. Minus two. Don't get a save. Three. So that's nine wounds. Nine damage. Here we oh, go. the ones. Uh, you kill seven of my hey. skelly bobs, but that's fine. That was the seven I brought back. Even down. Endless legions. Crell the Mortark of Despair. Five up ward. <laughs> um, now I did check his ability um, because it is specifically done in the hero phase. You yep. have to pick a death rattle skeleton unit or grave guard unit wholly within 12. Even though he has the death rattle keyword, he's not a death rattle skeleton. Five sixes. Oh. One on the floor. I'll just read Everybody do the dinosaur. Nice. Uh, one six. Okay, so I hit you three times. <laughs> do I wound you? Come on, Krell. Uh, six one is the wound. mortal wounds, isn't it? Sixes are two mortal wounds, so one wound at minus one. Five up. Nope, so that would be... Four damage, basically. Right, five ups. You, okay. I take three wounds off another. Doesn't quite kill one, no. which is a bit of a pity. My Mortis... Mortis guard? Mortet guard. Over here, we'll go see if I can chip some wounds off. Chippage. Threes and Threes fours. Threes and fours. Exploding sixes. Explody sixes. Explodes. Uh, so, I miss you twice, essentially. Oh, bam. But it is only four to it wound, wound you, yeah. so... I think there is an Ossiarch command to give you plus one to wound. I think there is, which but is quite I nice. want to save my stuff. That is just the three at minus one. Thanks. Three at minus one. So four plus save. Six up ward. No. Stab, stab. All right, ouch. Stab, 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 stab. Okay. Stab. I've piled in with the wolves. Uh, they do have a six inch pile in, which yes. is very nice. Um, it's also worth mentioning. I did what? attempt the counter charge, but you still have to roll the charge. And I rolled a three with Arkan. And I was specifically so... just over three, so that I, well, o over three. I was making sure just in case you rolled low, but also so that you couldn't pile it. Um, so it was still a failure. It's nice of me to take the cool thing and then I fail on it anyway. It's all right, my, I've not done my cool thing yet. So. That's true, we're both failures. It's always the way, it's like, oh, I'm gonna show off some cool things. No, right. no. Mm -hmm. for, for example, this thing here, this is the unit that I've marked up with my general, so that if they're within three, I hit them on twos. She's not gonna make it. Lol. That's sad. Anyway, wolves. 15 attacks, Ooh. fours and fours. Ooh. No rend, That's damage un. Un. They literally just go, um, um, um. Un damage. Um, 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 um. 
It's not bad. That's not shabby. Wolves. Uh, seven. Seven. Five, six, seven. Four upsides. Yes. All the sixes. Uh, uh. Do I shrug? Do you ward it? Uh, uh. I just ate two birds. They're, uh, they're very happy now. It turned on a bone. That's the, that's the tail and yet you deny my harvester the same <laughs> I don't want to fight joy. him, no. I'm, I'm going to kill your crow now. I'm full of despair. Gonna be, you're going to be crowled. <laughs> nice. <laughs> kind of works. Uh, well, that's not... I mean, I missed you three times, but I get an explodey, so... Okay, it's bodes well for crow. It's bodes well for crow. One at minus two. Five up. The more talk okay. of despair! My dread factions. Oh, the explode, I hate you all the times. Oh, we no. all the times, minus two. Five ups. Oh. Damage three apiece. Bomb. So it's nine damage. Oh, How many wounds does he have? Five. He'll be Fail. fine. He'll be Fail. fine. He'll be fine. Fail. I need to pass five six mm -hmm. up saves. Fail. No. He's, he's dead. But. I just wanted to do it. Uh, why the Indiana Jones thing? Because it's always in my head well, at any given time. He's going into my reviving pool. I hate your reviving because pool. I, so do I. I've not brought anything back yet. Uh, okay. And yet you still have so much on the table. I can't, yeah, no, but they're not very good. No. Not Manfred. Uh, his horse did nothing, as to be mm -hmm. expected. But now five attacks. Arr! Okay. It's okay. Drop two. Because it's freeze and freeze. Nice and simple. Uh, two wounds, minus one damage, two, so uh, four, four, uh, four up. Oh. Four damage. He carves apart four of them. Mm. More tech guard into the puppers. They. <laughs> Don't make me feel bad for this. <laughs> Don't do it! You know I get emotional over these things. And Why, Katie, them. when you play the Bone Reapers, do you always beat up doggies? Yeah. It's not First, it was Karen Axe, the wolves. I get two extra hits in there. Always to wound you. Yes, because they, they raise their, their blades Five and they're just like... One. Five, you say? Five. Um, so six up wards, because I've only got six up save. You killed two of my dogs! Take that, dogs. Mm. Takes you right for being a dumb animal. Uh, we could go straight over to my death rattle skeletons down here. Um, I've already piled in just to save everyone some time. I've got ten attacks. We love time saving measures. Falls and freeze. Fine. Yep. That's about, oh, goodbye. Ooh. That's about right. Well, I say about right. It is right. Freeze. That's not right. Uh, minus one, but you do have the mystic shoes. So, oh, I'm bomb. fine. <laughs> okay then. Yeah. Battle shock. It's just my skeleton. Yeah. It's just the necromancer. This necromancer is trying his hard. He's just like, <laughs> please, stay together, please. please. Um, so I lost seven. Uh, so that is 12. So two more crumble to dust ah. to be revived in a moment, yes. uh, one assumes. So you, no, not you, because you're holding the line. So you and you. There we go. Because okay. coherency is still an issue. Right. So I did achieve my battle tactic mm -hmm. for reviving a bunch. They still died. But that's fine. Um, I am currently holding just the one because yep. that is now contested, mm -hmm. um, which is something. So it's just the one over there. Krell's dead. Not holding that one. So be it. Priority roll. I'll go first. Please. So you'll go first. I will, yeah. What, what do I roll just out of interest? No, no. no not even close. I will take the turn. Okay. Yeah. Maybe my curse of years will do something. No. At around three and a couple of things have happened. Mm. <laughs> my battle tactic is... Um, Unfeeling recurring. That's the one, so I have to re construct three times. Fine. My bone tithe nexus. Not a one on. It's three ones in a row. Three ones in a row. Arkan, I, I thought I'll do I'll do some of the inconsequential stuff, or like the, the stuff that isn't going to hurt you off camera. I just do Emerald Life Swarm. Double what? It's because you were trying to cast a life spell as a deaf person. Oh, do you know what? That does make sense. Um, I did two mortal wounds, shrugged one of them, and now I can't cast anything else for the rest of the turn. So me hoping that I'll do something with Curse of Years this game is probably not going to happen. Your curse. But it is his best day ever. Yay! Um, I just need to roll to see if I get a CP with my general. Yeah. No. no, that's fine. Um, I have already bought back three Mortar Guard, guard the, with, with the Mortar of Sacrament. Now I'm going to roll to see if I can bring back a Stalker. Yeah, so annoyingly, I didn't win. Also, 
I forgot, yes, I know that there was the, uh, the the waste away on them, so he was minus one to wound and damage. I don't, I don't care. Mistakes happen. We're all doing the learns, okay? At least I told you what it was. You just, I'm sorry you didn't get to see it in action. Now, what is crucial here is because, uh, much like with other death stuff, you can only revive things if there aren't wounds allocated. So not doing a wound doom with the skelly bobs is really quite sad. Yep. Can I bring one back? No! Let me turn three up. No! I've got my... I bring one back. Da, 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 da. I think that is everything I need to mention. Um, um, I'm, you're not in range to do the. You want to re knit. I want over to there, re rather than using the more so, talk. So yeah. um, uh, you could do it over actually, here. Actually, yeah, I can do it there. I can heal Arkan, and then I can heal can the Arcan other guy himself. No, but re not for because um, it's a command ability. Re knit constructs. You are just out of holy within, so you can't bring those guys back. No, but the... I'm thinking what I might do is um i was just thinking of yeah. the just auto revive three with yeah. arkan yeah so you're just Ar arkan range. has an auto auto revive three and then i do have my renit constructs which i need to do three times anyway so i will be doing it here mm -hmm. i will be doing it over there because you can fall back and do it now because i can fall back and mm. do it and i might just do it on here so or do it on arkan so the gothas i will be ha healed by arkan Yes! So he'll heal, heal him, and then Renit Constructs will heal him. He'll heal him! If, look, I will say... Healy McNeely! I'm, I'm managing on like four hours sleep and I have a cold. Everything's very confusing right now. I'm so sorry. This unit is just going to fall back to make sure they're not within three. And we can move there. And I will Renit with them at the end of the movement phase. As this objective is now sticky, I'm just going to move my stalkers over to here. Goth boy is just going to move over here. <laughs> oh, it's also worth mentioning, I've changed the way around I've done this because Arkin can heal himself. I've healed him because he auto heals three wounds, whereas Rena is D3. Arkin had taken two, Goth had taken one. This way they both get fully healed. Arkin. Still have to stay outside of three. But. So we come to the end of the movement phase. I have done my Rena constructs. I've spent the three CP. I managed to fully heal my stalkers, fully heal the Gothasar Harvester, and bring back two of the Mortec Guard over there. So I have, like, I do now own that objective, which is nice. I'm going to bring back some oh. of my units. Mm -mm, no, thank you. Oh, come on now. This is really sad. I think it says no. I can finally do my... I think it's the Cauldron of Torment. Yes. Uh, so I've rolled, I've got 10 shots. I'm all out of fence, so I'm hitting you on twos as going into the Grave Guard because... All out attack? Like, Yes, that's the one. This has no rent. No rent. Okay, so I do have a four up from my Mystic Shield. You do. I miss you. Eh, the all that attack doesn't make any difference. But do you know what? That is five wounds, no rent. Four pluses. Bam. My uh, damage. Uh, just the one. Pretty sure it's two, you know. Is it? Pretty sure it's two. Let's check. Let's check. It is two damage, my mistake. It's all right. Six up wards. We have the one. I shrugged two of them, so six die. Okay. Uh, and I did the Gothasar off camera and it did nothing because it's a Gothasar harvester and he wants to play with the bows, not shoot them further away. Charge phase. Mm. Start with stalkers. We'll go sweep across the mat. A five. Oh. Just. Just. Fantastic. No more, no less than what you Gothic. required. Makes it. Yes. Arc it. An eight. Okay. Yay, that's that's my charge base. I'll just roll for the um, skelly bobs now. Yeah. Just calls. Tips. I bring back a large number of I them. I bring back <laughs> ten of them. That's my so goodness, funny. no, nine of them. Um, and then crimson feast and yes. crimson feast on the great card. Understandable. It should go without saying at this point. So if I don't say it, assume that I've done it. I am going to start with my stalkers over there just to see if I can do something. I do want to go into the Grave Guard, but the one with the Spirit Blades can't reach, so I may as well try and wipe the skeletons if I can. I understand. Um, I have minus one to wound and damage. I, I remembered. I'm all out attacking then. I'm and not I'm all out attacking. And I'm obviously doing the precision aspect, my plus one damage, so it kind of counteracts. Yeah. I'll start with the Falchion. Falchion. I hit you twice. Fours to wound you. Right. The Spirit Blades. Hits all the times. Hits all the times. Force to wound. Right. Hits all the times. Minus two, but only damage one now. Yeah, so just six up wards. Rebel the one. Skelly bobs. I'm just going to bring them back yeah. again. Yeah. <laughs> I've piled in with skelly bobs. Skelly. 
I've done free damage to your stalkers yeah. and now I'm going to stab your Gothasar Harvestar. He just wants to play. I'm not stabbing you. Let me collect your oh, bones. Oh, that's bad. Ah. Uh, five hits. Oh, chef. That's okay. They're not there to stab. They're there to not die. Four wounds minus one though because I've got a tide of bones. Damage one. I take two Stab, wounds. stab. You may attack me back when you wish. Yes, I'll wait until I've attacked stuff that can actually damage other things first. I like my wounds. I'm gonna go with Arkit next and see what damage I can do. Mm. Um, his two little blades, um, his staff and his blade have the same stats, so I may as well just do them together. Sure. Uh, these will be hitting on fours. Explodey! Hey! Because it counts Arkin. as an adroit weapon. Weaning on twos because of best day ever. That is three wounds at minus one damage two. I do not get a save. So, so I will do six. six ward saves in a moment. Okay, six ward saves in a moment. I've then got six attacks hitting you. Oh, these are these are the hoofs and the tufts. Hoofs and tufts. These well, are hitting on fours. The dread blades. He's not a naderite. He's not made of naderite. Ooh. The abyssal hound. Oh, I've had a three in there. Dread sorry. abyssal even. Two. Uh, that is four at minus two damage two. So it's eight wounds. Mm-hmm. Into my pool and of blender. I have six from the spectral claws and daggers, which does that count as the mount? Yes, it's a companion. Okay. So it will still get the plus two, <clears throat> but not exploding. Oh, so I only hit you once. The plus two, the plus one. Plus one to uh, Three still wound. No wound left. Okay. So I have a number of ward saves to make, that number being 14. Ooh. Six is. Re roll the ones? Uh, no, because no, they don't have a banner. Okay. That would be brilliant if they had. <laughs> Uh, but I do ward save three of them, so that's one, two, three, four, five and a half puppies dead. I, oh, there's one left. Two left. I did the wolves to try and kill some of the mortar, did and nothing. it didn't work. Nope. Mm. So I'll, I'll hit you back, and I might do something back. Three is. Mm. I did miss quite a few times, though. Mm. So. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I did miss you. Oh, good! Uh, that's... <laughs> uh, <Foster> wound. <laughs> that's quite a good roll. At least it's fours. Yes. Two, four, six, seven. Seven. Seven, please. Seven. 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 Um, one. The unit is exactly right. I killed the puppies! Do not call the RSPC on me, please! <laughs> The Grave Guard have piled in. Nine of them are in range. Obviously, the Crimson Feast has a total of 28 attacks. Scares me. I spent a CP on one out attack, and I got 24 hits, which is much better I've than last time. I've spent a CP on, on I get an extra ward save, because please. I can't remember what it's called. Was it is, is it indomitable or something? I don't know. Something. Something. Impenetrable Oh, fire. that's good. Ah! That's very good oh. indeed. So uh, that is, I dropped four. Uh, so that is 20 wounds, and we've got a bunch of sixes in there, which is uh, another five mortal wounds. Ooh. So five, 10, 22 even, because maths is hard apparently. Friend of one, yes? 22, no, that's not right. What am I talking about? Six, seven, eight, nine, 10. I don't know what's going on anymore. 20, uh, 18, come on brain, engage yourself. I'll take 18. four away then. Sorry. Five up saves, yeah? Uh, yes, minus one. Oh, goodness gracious me. Don't you and just these are two damage each. Um, two, four, six, eight, ten. So there's 25 ward saves to make in total with my decapitating strikes. Have, my cursed thin blades. I'm Killing fine. blow. I'm going fine. I just need to oh, save, what, like two thirds? Uh, oh. Yeah. I'm going to take what they've made. Not terrible, but, but they I, they are were, dead. Well, they will be dead, yes. I tried. Sharpen. I mean, it took me a while to chew through them, though. Nom, Good nom, lord. Nom, 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 I thought I'd fight you with the um, stalkers because we were kind of already know what's going to happen. I only managed to kill five, though. I did do all-out defense, and it powered up. I did. It does mean that you activate my god of stars ability, so I've chosen my stalkers. So I roll a dice each time I kill one of you, a, a, a unit or an enemy. On a four up, I get to heal them. So maximum of six. So I healed two so far. Okay, so far. So one is. Just I think when you, you roll, you roll the d6, and then you can pick a unit. Is that not the order? It doesn't matter. You've healed two wounds. But because I'm now you gonna could, like, attack with my bludgeoning bludgers. Bludgeoning bludgers. Sixes. No. Six attacks. Threes. Oh, so many sixes! <laughs> Ooh. I got four extra hits. Okay. <laughs> Threes to wound you. 
<laughs> what? Right. Four, uh, seven at minus two damage, two. Six up save. I save one. Damage, damage two, two, you say. Okay, I'm just gonna roll this twice because it's a bit easier. The first batch, the other one. No, that's six dead so far. Batch number two. Oh dear. You killed 12 of them. Ouch, Charlie. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. I'll just see if I can heal my um, last wound on my. Oh. Yes. Okay. I heal, I heal my stalker up completely. You don't want to do it to yourself as well? I, th I think you only choose one unit. Hmm. And it works on. I believe okay. that's how it works, if not. Oh. My other attacks. You've got more? Yeah, he's got a tail. He's oh, got his own tail. No. Okay. Which doesn't count as a mount. Because no. it's his tail. So yeah, he, he's tail. made of Naderite, I guess. Please. That is three at minus one damage two. Minus one damage two. Oh. Five ups. Okay. I have lost. Uh, I've got three left. I need to pass two of these. Oh, I've got one alive. <laughs> you know what that means. Don't bring them I'm back! I'll be bringing the load back Stop next it! turn! Battleshock? You're no, going to lose no, that final that, no, guy? Spending my nope. the inspiring yep. presence on that. Mm. Yep, that's yep. not... Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Right, so... I got my battle tactic. You did. And I'm holding one, two, and more. You did. Here we go. Oh, you. Um, it's my turn now. So many. I could really do with bringing something back to life now, <laughs> although I do have Graveguard able to go and duff up stuff, so that is absolutely going to happen. And then I'm going to duff you out with my, my multi crawler. It's fine. I look. It's fine. My turn. I have done desecrate their lands on the dragon thing because I'm just It's gonna, also in my territory. It's in your yeah. territory, so I'm just going to just swarm it with stuff. Yeah. Um, ah, I dropped a dice. I've done my Deathly Invocation uh, on units. Now, because all of my units are wholly within 12 of a gravesite, I, I bring back one extra model. So every unit has revived four models, That's which nice. is very nice. You'll also notice that my uh, Not Manfred is fully healed because he is a white king on steed. He is summonable and you heal summonable units if they're wholly within 12. This is why these guys are much more expensive than they were because they basically heal free wounds yeah. automatically whilst they're still alive in your hero phase, which is really good. In terms of heroic actions, because I've gone second, Galatian champion time, I've done get a CP, didn't work. I did get a CP. You did get a CP with Arkham. <laughs> um, I have also done premeditated bloodshed because this is something cool and new to show off, which is she ignores ward saves. I don't like Ooh, that because that's really my whole cool. shtick is having a ward save. Have you seen my army? I roll better than you. True. Um, <laughs> I did manage to get Waste Away off with uh, my Necromancer onto Arkham the Black, so he's minus one wounded damage. I tried Soul Pike over here, but it was no. denied. Spirit Gale. Uh, it does go off on an 8 because I'm more than 3 inches away from stuff. It does, it does go, off. go off. Everything what? takes a mortal wound. We'll do the uh, ward saves off yes. camera if it's relevant. We will let you know. Last Don't time I relevant. killed some more tech guard, that was kind of it. Yeah. I then bought them back, so it's fine. That's it for the hero phase. Nothing else to do. Let's do some movement. Twinsies! Moving up. I'm, are you going to read I will, one? yes. All right. Road of 4. And of course I used his free CP that he gained yeah. at the beginning of the turn. It's like, it's just beep, 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 beep. Also, Spirit Gale wounded everything, everything successfully. Absolutely everything. I didn't make a single ward save, so I think that was revenge for my comment on rolling better than you. <laughs> the Grave Guard have begun the move. It's also so that I know exactly where the free inch mark is for those Mortec guards. It's a guard off. No, you're a skeleton. <laughs> I have run with the Death Rattle and the Necromancer. We got a five on the Necromancer and we got a four for the Skeletons. It doesn't matter about blocking off the Vampires because they do have the Fly keyword, but important. And into bats. Yes, important for getting the Desecrate Lands. Not Manfred. <laughs> and obviously not with him free, you know. End of the movement phase. Yeah. Do I bring a unit back? The Grave Guard. Yay! Yay! Praise be! I'm gonna go over. Now I can't charge, I can't pile in, I can't do anything like that, but I am going to go Still an objective. over here. Still an objective. It's mine because I can appear within gravesite. Yay! Charge time. I'm going to start with the Grave Guard. Mm. 
because um, of your mortise thing. You yes. Could, you can attempt to charge a unit. So it's when I finish a charge move within 12 inches of it, you can attempt to charge. You don't have to charge that unit. So you could, in theory, use that to charge away from stuff. Yeah. Um, or if I start over here, then you charge with the I charge there and, just and block, block you. off, which is not what I want. Yeah. So I'm going to do the Grave Guard. It's a seven. I'm going to go and murder stuff, please. Sure. Not Manfred. It's also worth mentioning mm. I've used the um, counter-offensive, I believe it's counter-offensive, or Arc mm. Bone Reaper mm. ability, uh, which happens at the charge phase to give my Arc and plus one to wound in the preceding phase. <sighs> no, a... preceding, following phase. Yes. Oh, it's a really big charge, which would potentially... Oh, no, I, won't. I needed a double six to get in range um, to, to charge there, so I'm just going to go me. round there. Um, he does D3 mortal wounds on a two plus on the charge. I don't like that. He does the big three. But does he? I have one, one left, left alive. Um, we're just going to try it with the Vampire Lord. I need, again, quite a high charge because of Fly. No. Not that. That's that's fine. that's fine. Um, this Vampire Lord? Oh, it's risky. I'm going to try. Okay. We're going to try. No. No. Well, I mean, yes, but that would go into Arkham, but she's not ignoring ward saves, which is a bit sadder. Um, so I'm just going to leave it like that because I can sit there and hold the objective, which is the dragon. I just have to roll for all of my skeletons. There's 15 yeah. of them. How many will there be? So How many, many skeletons Please stop bringing back skeletons. will there be? Please don't. There's currently five. No. We don't want it's a skeleton. currently scaling. five. It's That's not. Okay. It's not as good as the previous it's rounds. Four ups, isn't it? Uh, it's four. It is four ups. Which is still, I, I do bring six back. That is not going to be enough to keep them alive. No. Um, but that's fine. The grave guard have begun. I have spent. Uh, I've done the crimson feast. Obviously, um, I have done all last attack. Yep. I had twenty eight attacks into Mortec guard, and I've got twenty four into Ark of the Black against the Mortec guard. I did one mortal wound and eleven saves. However, I've got many. I've got in my head. Mm. Um, and Arkan has done the. Get a five-up ward. I understand. So fives to save for the Mortec Guard. Oh, no. That's a lot of two One, damage. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, no. So that's 19. 19 five-ups and ward saves. Nine, and I've got the extra one here. I'm going to be fine. I'm dead. Not a bad guy. It's a good guy. But I am dead. It's a good guy. Okay. We're now going to do all of the attacks into Arkan on camera. So there's a lot of stuff going on here. Basically, the waste away... Like when, when you come to attacking me, yes. the waste away has been counted out by your counter strike. Yep. And you currently have a free up save base. Free up save, so I'll be a four up and then a five up ward. Because of the whatever it's called. Oh, there's a lot of twos. No. Oh, oh, so many oh. twos. Heartbreaking. So many twos. I would say my heart bleeds, but I'm a skeleton and I have no organs. <laughs> I beat there. That would be even worse than just a skeleton. Mm. Like a skeleton, skeleton with, with all the organs. Ugh. How would you, you just have to be holding them in all the time? I mean, I wouldn't I wouldn't worry about the logistics of it. There's skeletons that go around going, do do They oh. don't, they go. Yeah. What about they sentient no organs with none of the skeletons? Uh. Oh, it's just a, a walking nervous system. Oh, no, uh, God, Nurgle. no. Yes. So that is five, ten, and minus one, and one mortal wound on top. So ten, four up, please. Four up. Okay. Two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, 13. five, six. Thirteen. So I six. don't think he can die because they've got like four. The Mortox have like fourteen wounds now. They're much beefier. He has taken a wound. The five up does come in yeah. quite clutch though. So I end up actually taking seven. So he's now taken eight wounds. All right. So he's Ouch. not dead yet again yet, but I've done some significant damage. I'm going to go with the Gothasar Harvester next because I might be able to heal up my um, everything that's Healing around there. Healing. So I'm going to start with my bludgeons. Fear the bludgeons. Um, Two I miss sixes, you. though. Yes. Threes to wound you. Um, I can't all out defense no. here. So. That is three at minus two. So six damage. Uh, yes. Ward saves. Reroll the ones because there is a banner in there. No, there's not, apparently. Six. Six dead. How do I heal myself? Yes. So both are now healed because I rolled two fives. Mm -hmm. And then my own hoofs and tufts. I hit you three times. Three is to wound. These are minus one. Do you get a minus save? Five? Yes, just minus Sixes. one. Sixes! I save one. Then two damage pops that'll be Damn four it. damage. Oh, come on. The ward saves have yeah. really not done well over on this side. So, so that is ten. Okay. So that is two left alive. Perfect for the stalkers. Arkin. Mm. Uh, he's slightly degraded, which means that his Ebon Claws has less attack. But which is useful. That's it. 
again, his his actual attacks are the same stats. So we'll do them all together. Yes. Hitting fours. I get three hits. Three is to wound you. Yeah, because That's of the just the one wound minus one. Minus one. Six up two. Damage two. Damage one because you are wasting away. Yes. Six up ward. No. Nope. So, so there's one. one there. So Arkham will heal at the end of the yes. fight because of the, the Ebon Claws. He's not He is not. He doesn't getting get the explodies, but I do hit you all the time. Threes. That is three at minus two. I don't get to save. So there will just be one damage because of the minus one. Three, you say? Yes. Come on, Ward saves. It's another and then three there. The spectral claws and dagger. I only hit you three times. Mm. I only wound you once. My uh, no rent. Oh, one damage. Blow me oh, I can reroll the ones with my standard. Blow me neck. Right. So yeah. I do heal five. So I'm back to taking three wounds. Five. But I kill five of you. Yay. You did kill five. Rest of the combat has been done because think, you've seen this combat yeah, and it was it one guy against the White King. He died. Um, I did two attacks over here into the Gothisar and I wounded you with a rend of one because I outnumber you, lol. Six. But you're fine. In style. Battle, Battle shock. shock. Right. The Death Guard. Death Guard? Grave Guard lost five. Different game system. Uh, they're fine. Okay. The bravery is ten. Skelly Bobs. They lost ten. So on a one, there's one guy left alive. Oh, it was so close to greatness. It was a two. It was a two. Yeah. Okay, these skelly bobs are Hi. gone, but might be back because they now go into my pool of potential okay. revivings. Um, so I have got all of the objectives yep. on the battlefield. And, because, and, the, um, and the desecrate your land objective. I've desecrated this skull because I've got loads of yes. stuff over here. Um, I've got uh, more than yeah. five grave guard models in range of that objective, and I'm now holding There's nothing there, and I have nothing there. So, so great success. Your turn to roll Priority. First. No, I rolled first last time. No, I rolled. So you rolled first the first time. I rolled yeah, I first. I rolled a three. Yeah. Okay. This is good for me. Yay. Yeah, I'm taking that and double turn. we forget, these will disappear. Yep. Yeah, Battle round four. At the start of battle round. Landslide. Everything is gone. Does that mean everything on the flanks just dies because they get killed in the landslide and then I have more stuff than you? My turn four. They've disappeared. I'm taking eye for an eye as my battle oh, tactic. Um, there's a great one called, um, I think it's called the uh, Finest Vintage, which is Ooh. pick an enemy hero and kill them with a vampire hero, but uh, I'd rather just take yeah, eye yeah. for an eye, which is a bit boring, I know, but you know, I'm going to hedge my bets. Yeah. I've healed uh, this unit back to full. Um, my Grave Guard will not wholly within range of a grave site, so they've just brought back the free for being wholly within 12 of a hero, though. Great success. Um, I successfully cast Spirit Gale on an unmodified nine. Yep, everything took two mortal wounds everything except Arkan, who took one. Very good. Uh, I tried to cast Waste Away, didn't happen. Yep. I um, didn't get an extra CP for my heroic action. I didn't roll for an extra CP. I'll but do that now. No. no, that's fine. Because you know what is going to happen? The Purple Sun of Shayish. No! I cast it on a nine with my plus one from my vampire lady down here. With a plus two, that is an eight. Please don't eat my thing. Bowling ball of no! doom! Yeah. Oh, oh. There oh, we go. Okay. okay. It's now the end of the hero phase. Bowling ball no! of doom! So I can't remember how the purple sum works. So I roll a d6 for each model within uh, each unit yep. within uh, range. So on your stalkers, I think it's a one. Hang on. I, I've got the Check rules it. here. Da, 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 da. Uh, the chef entertained them. So, subtract one from save rolls for everything within six. Total the unit, and in three. addition, roll a dice for each unit within three on a one. It's lame. Okay, so that's the old version. So it is a yeah. one. The stalkers. No, <laughs> the Gothasar halves it. So it's not <laughs> slain, but it takes d6 yeah. plus six mortal wounds. So stressed. <gasps> yes, I'm gonna eat something with a purple <laughs> d6 sun. plus six. Oh, seven. seven. He won't die. Well, that, oh, yeah. He yeah. gets the ward save. Oh yes, of course, of course. I do. But, oh man! It's not like our practice games where a great Pokemon got eaten. Do you want to just, just re-roll that? Because it's boring. No, you know? that's not the rule. I know, but it's dumb. Uh, still, I do take six. six mortal wounds, though. It's fine. And there's a purple sun there just yeah. going... <laughs> uh, right, let me do some movement. There's not going to be a huge amount, uh, because it's basically just vampires and uh, graveguard. 
The Grave Guard begin their remorseless move up here. You ran five inches away from me! Yes, I did. I redeployed because I'm scared. Rude! I'm trying to keep my stuff alive! Not Manfred! Vampire! Vampire! Because fly. Um, the Death Rattle will advance, run, a five. So they will form up ranks to protect my home objective and my Necromancer. The Shambling Hordes have moved up. The Necromancer is happy as a clan where he is. He's been tasked by the vampires to hold this point. All we need to do now is roll to see, can I bring a unit back? No! It's my movement phase on a free plus. <sighs> no. Bard, you will appreciate this. No! So, because I, because I can arrive um, sort of within, I can't pile in or anything like that, but. <clears throat> Ring my crow. Ring my Krell. Um, I'll actually move him like there because that's much cooler. Oh, oh, Krell. It is now the charge phase. Not Manfred. No, I'll spend a CP to re-roll it because I need an eight into the Mortec crawler. Ooh. Oh, there we go. Smash. Uh, dun, 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 dun. <laughs> I'll just do my mortal wounds now. It does go off and I do the big free again. Go on, not Manfred. You do what? Oh, uh, not Manfred. It's because you're not Manfred. The Grave Guard. An eight again over here. Redeploy enough. Oh, yes. In we go. Oh, Murder. No. Moiders. Moiders. That's my thing. I think it's Boston's thing. <laughs> Vampire time. Seven will make it because no. of fly. No. Why Vampire stop? two. No, you're being lazy. That's yes. fine. Okay. Um, for um, what it's worth, I'm going to give counter offense to my stalkers. Sure. Let's see if I get muddy. No, I'm going to go first. Yes, but I might live, and then I could kill you back harder, and then that would bring me some joy. I, that didn't make much sense. I'm apologizing. The Grave Guard have kicked off the fight phase with a. Um, I don't need to revive anything. This is very nice. I don't need to roll any dice. Um, we're doing. Um, oh! You get to stomp and stuff. Oh, I forgot. We didn't, we didn't do that last turn. What would you have done? Last turn, probably a stomp. Stomp away. Well, do I stomp? Yes. Yes. To one. No. No. And then for this <laughs> turn? Stomp. Two. Okay, so three are dead, basically. Yeah. That's fine. I killed them. Yeah. Nice. It wouldn't have made any difference to morale or anything no. like that last turn. Um, or, I mean, I would have had one less attack on the Mortec, but they took a ton of damage. I was so dead. Right, over here, I've spent my last CP for all-out attack. I spent my not last CP on all-out defense. Yes. Um, yeah, it was worth pointing out, you only got one extra CP this turn because you only had four units yes. on the board. Um, I have done 14 hits. That's what they're called. Woundage. Not bad lads so that is three mortal wounds in addition and 12 wounds at minus one with a further minus one because of the purple yeah. sun of sheesh it's so it still ends up being five because it's my life yes oh sorry remove i'm them, trying please. oh no Ooh, the purple sun uh two four six eight nine one two three four five six seven eight nine and then 18 the plus three is 21 Lots of shrugs. Ooh. Oh, drop one. That's not bad. Oh, we've got a spinner. Um, Six is this time. Yes. yes. So that is uh, one holy One's dead. One's taken, two, taken yeah. two, yeah. they're so dead. Clean so with the grave guard. I, they're probably going to get eaten by a Gothasar yes. now, but that's fine. Yes. So my Gothasar Harvester's ability is any time a model is slain within six inches. So I was Pretty like, oh, cool. cool. I, like, I could heal three wounds for each one yeah. that I rolled four up on. What did I roll, Chef? The triple one. <laughs> this is, do you know what? My luck's just turned since I, t uh, since I said that I roll better than you. So I think Zinch is present and is, I have clearly wound them up. Yeah. I'm gonna go with Arkin now. I'm gonna spend my last one point on that attack because feel like it's my last ditch hope into the grave guard see if i can kill them so be threes and threes with my arcan attacks great it's also worth pointing out that there wasn't a monstrous action done over here with the goth side because i wasn't quite within in three combat. inches at the time after my pile in i, I am have now in three hits no wounds <laughs> oh my god my spectral claws and daggers Okay, three, 
Balls to wound you here. Two wounds, no right. On the grave guard? Yeah. You wound one. Damage of one. Oh, goodbye. Ward save. Rebound the one for the standard. You <laughs> kill one with a ghost. Okay. <laughs> I get to heal a wound on myself. Yay! So. <laughs> I did my attacks with not Manfred off camera. Um, I did three wounds in total yeah. with my lance. Horse did nothing. Well, I've got, only got six wounds left, so you could actually kill me here. Um, he will live. I saved one, but I've got my shrugs. I have three wounds left. Okay. Me. Next turn, Fine. maybe. It's gothy. Gothy saw. Goth yes, boy! You were within three, so my bludgeons. Can I bludgeon you to death? Oh, no explodey bludgeons. No explodies. And I'm not getting a save here because uh, there, that is there is just a purple. Two wounds, um, two damage each. Uh, three are dead. My hoofs and turfs. I can explode those, so I hit you all the time. You're made of nadrite. <laughs> I am made of nadrite. Thank you for noticing. So that is two at minus one. You kill another four. Seven that are dead. There's only three hey. alive. Your your healing McDeely? Oh, uh, how did I kill? Seven. <sighs> five, six, Hep seven. Hepatopus one. You I do heal one, two, three wounds. I've only taken the five. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> Grave guard off camera. Thirteen hits mm -hmm. into Ark on the Black. Oh, goodness <laughs> me. Uh, so that is three mortal wounds in addition. Okay. That is nine at minus one. Four ups. Okay. Yeah. Two damage a pop. So, and three mortals in addition. Uh, yes. So it's nine damage. Chop, chop, chop. He takes seven wounds. Seven, okay. So he's got four wounds he's left. He's taken ten. Uh, yeah, yes, four total. wounds left. Yeah. Um, we'll do the more tech crawler off camera because it's mm. a catapult. The Vampress. Yes. Kerrigan, the Queen of Blades. Ooh. Ooh. So she's got an extra attack because she's a Legion of Blood in combat, basically. Uh, she loses Noi. her casting, but she goes... She's I'm... really, really angry. Moida. Ah. I hit you all of the oh, times! no! Ah. The six has been nothing. Freeze to wound you. I wound you four times. Minus one. Damage two, however. Four up. Six damage. You need to pass uh, three ward saves or Arkham. The black. Does she dead? have the thing where she ignores wards? No, that's a heroic action which uh, only lasts. Okay. I did it in a previous turn. I tried to get a CP this turn. Oh, only just dead. precision <laughs> blows. Da, 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 da. He just dead now. <laughs> well, with that, I am holding all of the objectives because there's only two. Um, I've gotten my battle tactic. I have tied up your shooting. Yep. There's I a... can't get my um, grass strategy. No. With the units I have. Um, do you want to see if you can kill my goth star? It's the end of the hero phase. Yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> do I eat a, a blade, a, a, a grave guard? No. No, it's a free. Do I eat the goth hey! <laughs> oh, He's only got five wounds left. So he takes six plus seven again. Okay. Fine. Three, four, five, six, seven. He's eaten the governor! <laughs> so yeah, that that's that's <laughs> excellent. So in your turn, yeah. you could fight me. The the, the crawler did nothing no. last turn. No. It, the crawler has three wounds left. Three no, it's taken. I think I have I three think, wounds I, left. I think our endless spell has been moving the I dice think endless around. spell has been getting confused. Yeah. Um, maybe. So th that was savage. That was, that was, that was an incredible, incredible he, game. You could have gone both yeah. ways very quickly. Yeah. Well played. Oh, no. New book. That was really fun. New we did it. And I mean, whole new army for you as well. Whole new army for so me. You've not played um, yourself like before. Can I just roll to see if I can bring um, yes, some. Absolutely. Let me, I let feel me like I, I should bring some doggos back. Yeah, at the end of your movement phase, I bring doggos Puppies. back. The, the, do the doggos really are don't here. don't need to be called on me. That's good. <laughs> the, do the doggos have come up here because yeah. they, there's just a massive pile yeah. of bones now, and they're just like yeah, he's howling at the purple sun. all of the bones mm. that the, the are collected sun. has spilled out. They're looking for that. No. I really enjoyed that. I think the changes to the Bone Reaper book mm. makes it much kind of simpler to wrap your head around. Yeah. Um, There's definitely a lot of depth in it though, because if is. you can kind of really get yeah. your head around there all are some, of the, some the pro CPs. Strats and top tier yeah. plays and tactics. Yeah. And also, we, we don't have like the Mortisons. There's some really powerful abilities that you yeah. can do with the Mortisons, um, like extra spells cool. that you've got. Um, but yeah, yeah, overall, yeah, they've received a much needed guard. The Soulblight are interesting. Yeah. They played very much like they did before. Yeah. Graveguard are just 
bonkers They're good. They're so good. Um, and the reviving mechanic, because you can't charge from the revive, it mm. does make them a little bit less feel bad. Yeah. But the three inches away opens up so I many options. I think against um, elite armies is going to be quite nasty as well, because you can't then spread out to stop them from taking objectives yeah. that are sticky, because that was like, even I was kind of struggling and I yeah. didn't have that few units. But yeah, very interesting yeah. game, very enjoyable. Um, I really like to, the play style of the how these kind of go on go in future games. Eventually we will expand all these armies as That's you know guys. Fletcher. But Fletcher's painting space wolves. We asked him if he would paint us and he said no. I, I believe his response was wolf. Yeah he he's just become a one word man and that word is wolf. 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 Thank you for joining us. I hope you enjoyed that. We certainly did. New books are fun. Yeah. Praise, Sigma is fun. Sigma is fun. Praise we be. have fun. Pra Look, Tabletop Tactics is awesome. Nagash is the winner here. Because it's, absolutely. Wins. And That's if you wins. made it this far in the video, be sure to like and subscribe. Leave us comments. Let us know what you want to want, want to see from us. And if you want to see even more of the content, go check out On Demand where we have hundreds more videos and we literally can't do this without the support of our On Demand bosses. You're the ones that make it possible. We You're the you dream so team. Much. Yeah. We love you. These two are both ill, so we'll say goodbye yeah. for now. I've been Chef, she's been Jinx, our Ember spell has been the Bard. That's been the Purple Sun, you've been Bosses, and we'll see you next time.